Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. This is our 45th tutorial of Power BI. In the previous class, we have learned about the dashboard and the difference between dashboard and report. I hope guys, now you have good understanding between reports and dashboards. And now in today's class, we will study some more feature about Power BI services. So our today class topic is licensing. So firstly, we will discuss what is licensing and why it is required. So we need licensing here in Power BI services to perform additional features. Without licensing guys, we can't perform any additional features. To unlock additional features, we need license here. So in Power BI services, we have three kinds of licensing. The first one is Pro, the second one is Premium per user and the third one is Premium per capacity. So in today's class, we will understand about these licensing differences which is really important to know guys. So let's go to the Microsoft page directly. And here we will understand the differences of licensing. So here is the page guys and I will share this link of this page. So you guys can also check the differences later. So guys, firstly we will talk about the prices. So for pro users, the cost is 720 rupees. And for the premium per user, the cost is 1440. And for the premium per capacity user, the cost is 3,59,865. And if you calculate this cost in dollars, guys, so for pro users, licensing cost is $9.99. And it may be fluctuate in future. And for the premium user, its total cost is $20. And for the premium per capacity user, its cost is $4,995. So we guys can see per capacity cost is too high as compared to per users and pro. So this is the first difference guys between these three licensing. Now moves towards the another differences. And I scroll down this page. So here guys we can see lot of differences. And here we will only read few major differences, rest differences you need to explore yourself. So now we will talk about model size. So for pro user, model size limit is 1 GB. And for premium user, model size limit is 100 GB. And for the premium per capacity, model size is 400 GB. So here model size means the whole Power BI model guys. Now comes to the third difference which is refresh rate. So guys we have a feature in Power BI services which name is schedule refresh. We will cover this topic in our upcoming classes. So for now only we only need to understand the refresh rate difference. So for pro user they can refresh the data 8 times in a day. And for the premium user they can refresh the data 48 hours in a day. And the last one is premium per capacity. They can also refresh the data 48 hours in a day. So that means premium per user and premium per capacity refresh rate is same. So now guys move toward the another difference of Power BI licensing. So here is the maximum storage. So for pro user they can fetch the data up to 10 GB. And for the premium per user they can fetch the data up to 100 TB. And for the premium per user capacity they can also fetch the data up to 100 TB. So these are the major differences guys which we have discussed. So let me scroll up this page. And we can see these have more features in Power BI services. But they can't differentiate these three licensing. Because these features are accessible for all three licenses, Like mobile app access, paginated reports and the third one is connect to more than 100 data source. You can see this dot sign in three licensing. That means this is accessible for all the three license. So guys we have studied various difference of licensing under this tutorial and I hope guys you are clear with the concept of licensing in Power BI services and in upcoming class we will study few more feature about Power BI services and quickly wind up this Power BI whole course. And after that guys, I will start separate scenario and tricks 
separate DAX playlist, separate visual playlist, and some interview scenarios. But these things will take more time, obviously. So be practice yourself, guys, and try to explore more about Power BI. And if you need any kind of support from me, I am ready to help you guys. It's totally free here for my viewers and my subscribers. And I am frequently posting jobs opening in LinkedIn and Telegram Power BI groups. So you guys can follow me on LinkedIn as well. And link is given under the description box. And thank you so much guys for your more love and support. And please spread this channel into your network and share with those who really want to learn Power BI from scratch. And the last thing guys, don't forget to press the bell icon as you will miss an update. And don't forget to like, comment and share. Thank you so much guys and stay tuned with us for more learning about Power BI. Thank you so much guys.